In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to configure VLAN on your Ubiquiti device and integrate that with Mikrotik router. First, let me show you the configuration on Mikrotik. So here I have created a VLAN with the name of testing for UBNT and the VLAN ID as well and the interface that's going to be the interface which is connected to the UBNT device and this is the IP address for that VLAN okay and now I'm going to connect my computer with the UBNT device and you can see it's connected and it's showing the IP address 10.0.2 which I assigned this one statically right and now I'm going to ping the Google server and probably it's not going to respond let me try picking the gateway which is 10.0.1 and most probably it's not going to respond because VLAN is not yet configured on UBNT device okay let's ping the UBNT device and let's see if I can ping that one so that's 192.168.1.22 yes i can ping that okay so let's start the configuration first i'm going into the portal and uh, let's log in with the username and password and then you have to go to the network section if you're new to this channel make sure to subscribe the channel and click the bell icon to get the notification of my upcoming videos before we move forward, I request you to click on the like button and leave a comment that from what city you are watching this video from. And under network sections, you need to change the configuration mode to advanced. And under VLAN network, we need to set the VLAN ID on both interfaces, LAN0 and WLAN0. And then we need to click on the bridge network. And then we are going to create a bridge and we will add the VLAN 225 with LAN 0 and then we'll create another bridge that's going to be bridge 1 and then we will add WLAN 0 and then the LAN 225 and then you need to click the change button and then apply if you want to but in my case I'm going to test the settings first so I'm going to see if I can ping any of the network uh, where I started pinging so let's test that in ubiquity devices when you update any changes it takes few seconds to update so i hope i would be able to ping in couple seconds so uh, now you can see i could ping uh, the google dns and also i can ping the gateway so yeah it's super easy to configure but you have to understand the configuration how you configure the bridges and the vlan it's kind of complicated but not impossible thank you so much for watching the video and if you like the video make sure you hit the like button and subscribe the channel i will see you in the next video bye bye and again make sure to hit the subscribe button thank you